hi my beautiful viewers all over the world you are welcome to my channel guys today's topic i want to show you guys how you can use purple lotion in an effective way how you can mix this purple lotion some people are saying it gives them stretch marks it's giving them green veins it's giving them white patches how can you use this without having stretch marks white patches green veins number one guys <clears throat> sorry i have cough i have cold guys you need to exfoliate your skin you need to prepare your skin towards this lotion you need to look for a good scrub use a good scrub to scrub yourself three times in a week if it's peeling you need to peel your skin so that new baby skin can come out guys so that new baby skin can come out before you start using this product so how can you pro mix this product number one you need pigment dose you need pigment dose if you want to use this purple as a super super whitening lotion you need pigment dose you know all of us know pigment dose is filled with um, alpha hydroxyl acid that is AHA alpha hydroxy acid AHA, then other whitening ingredients. So you know, the um, pigment dose is a whitening concentrate. It's a super, super whitening concentrate. That is for pigment dose. Then if you are using 300 ml, you need one of pigment dose, guys. If you are using 300 ml, you need one pigment dose. So look for a container, add, add this to your container, add one pigment dose then the next thing you need is your vitamin e make sure you can even open this vitamin e this one is drinking you can look for the cosmetics vitamin e put it inside your lotion don't remove it don't open it just add it like if you are using 300 me you can use five of this you can use five vitamin e you can use five vitamin e then the next thing I want to, the most important thing is essential oils. You can look for good concentrated essential oils. Just one, two, three drops of any essential oils in your vicinity is okay. One, two, three drops of any, as if it might be Navida essential oil, it might be rose, rose, uh, rose hip essential oil, it might be rosemary essential oil, it might be jojoba essential oil it might be jasmine essential oil any essential oil available guys add one two three to it add one two three to it the nice thing is your penetrator guys please don't go ahead and use propenic glycol you can have propenic glycol to it then make sure you look for good penetrator because the reason why I'm saying this, all these companies cannot use these penetrators because these penetrators are so very, very expensive. They are expensive. Once they use this kind of penetrators, how much are they going to sell this? How much are they going to sell this? So penetrators, one liter is 70,000, one liter is 80,000, one liter is 100,000. So if they, if they are using penetrators, it, they, they will not sell this cheap so if you can go to any organic stores tell them to give you good penetrator apart from propenic glycol they are going to give you good penetrators and this good this one now i bought it from china indian china this is where i bought my penetrators from so this one is going to help this product to penetrate to the third layers of the skin so if you are adding this to your purple, you will not have white patches. Because the reason why you are having white patches is because this cream is working at the surface of the skin. It's not penetrating deeper. That is why you are having white patches. But if you can add a good penetrator to your lotion, honestly speaking, you are not going to have white patches because this can tackle reactions on its own. It can tackle stretch mark, it can tackle white patches, and is a penetrator. 
it makes your product to work faster it makes your product to work faster so we have different types of penetrators we have like five or seven classes of penetrators so just go to any organic stores tell them to give you original penetrators because some are mixing these penetrators i've bought many penetrators in nigeria some are mixing it with ethanol but if you know if you've been buying from companies you will know that you are too hard you will know the difference you will know the difference but make sure where you are buying from tell them to give you good penetrators and another thing guys sunscreen there are liquid sunscreen out there you can add to your lotion because this lotion like this it contains hydroquinone it contains hydroquinone so anything that is acidic that contains hydroquinone you need to add your sunscreen to it so you can visit any organic stores tell them to give you good sunscreen you can add to your lotion tell them to give you good sunscreen you can add to your lotion so once you have good sunscreen to your lotion you are good to go then the next thing you need to use is your limb oil guys this is seed limb seed oil this will tackle your reactions this will tackle white patches this will tackle brain veins for those of you that your clients normally have green veins white patches make sure you had limb oil please make sure it's the original limb this is original when i mean original is the seed is not the leaf is not the leaf so this is what i normally had to my face cream to my body cream if i'm producing with anything that contains super super whitening because it's going to tackle all those things so your clients will not have white patches they will not have green veins make sure they are promixing this is your number one power this is your number one you need to add to your lotion then your penetrators is number two your vitamin e is number three because this lotion they said it contains propenin glycol codic acid aha sodium metabisulfite citric acid and ipm you see ipm can penetrate Propenic glycol is the penetrators, but they are for the small boys like this. They are for the big small boys. But if you want to achieve with the big boys, you need to use big boys penetrator. So you can see IPM is a penetrator. It makes your product penetrate. It's for like the black market. So propenic glycol too is for like the black market production. So if you want your client to really look good, flawless, without having white patches, without having you need to add good penetrators to your production. So in here is not written hydroquinine because they know once it's written there, it chased people away. But it's, it's acidic and it's not meant for dark skin, please. If you are a dark skin, make sure you dilute it with Johnson lotion or coconut oil or shea butter if you want to use this as a dark skin. So guys, I'm going to stop here for today. If you love this video, give me thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. Thank you and God bless you.